Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. A bit of a bonus one for you today, as I've recently got this Scoville Evra for a second hand. Um, it didn't come in a box or anything like that, I just bought seen and sold. Um, and as you can tell by this one, if you've not seen them already, by Tower, obviously the same brand as me, Jewel Compartment one, it looks exactly the same. Um, let's say the the design of it, like I say, the, maybe the aesthetics, maybe this is a little bit different with Tower, maybe a different colour. Um, but yeah, it looks, I would say kind of looks exactly the same, my opinion, comment below if, if I'm wrong anyway. Um, obviously they just don't put Scoville, they just put Tower there. So, um, <clears throat> because you've got all the controls, which are along the, along the top here, obviously all touch controls, even though you can't even see it, it just looks like a big dark um, like top, a glossy top. But anyways, um, going into the specs, I think I don't know the wattage on this one. Um, again, I'll, what I'll do, I'll put a link in the description to this one because this is only exclusive to ASDA. Um, you can only yeah, you can only buy these in ASDA. I'm not going to disclose the price because price changes all the time, and I don't want to be going. And oh, you priced it this one when you recorded it. And it's not this price. Yeah, I know. Um, so yeah i'm not i'm just gonna put a link in the description if you want if you're interested in buying one of these i will give like again like a review after so many uses of using it um so this does um i think it's 2000 watt this one um don't quote me on that one again the specs will be on the um in the link anyway um so i'm just gonna quickly turn it on you hear it beep as soon as you turn it on so we open it up you'll hear a, dub, hear a double beep and obviously you've got a said light we have so what i got with it is the two um the two baking trays like that and then you also get your your, your drip tray um so the reason i'm taking that out is so you can actually see inside it is an 11 litre capacity like i say this is a single cavity um air fryer not obviously jaw compartment so this is the reason why i wanted to buy this so because i've got my halogen next to it if i want to do any different times and different cookings and that's what i'm just going to use both of them rather than the towel one because that one will go um it i didn't have the accessory for it but um i'm just going to quickly move so you can see um inside here you've got these uh um oh, got these holes here and obviously on and then on this side so what it is you'll have like a, a rotisserie so you can actually cook a big whole chicken in there um so and i think there is a there's a function that probably may activate this rotisserie part but i mean i'm gonna have to call um the hot the uh hotline um on the scoville website because there is actually a scoville website where i can even though it's by asda but i can get spare parts for it so hopefully I can um, cook a whole roast chicken in there. Obviously, uh, depending on how big the chicken is, I can get. So, um, so I'm just going to keep you uh, up and over so I can just show you the top of it. Um, so you can just about see here that we've got our on-off button and start and pause. So, so when I turn it on, if, if I can turn it on. No, I know why, because you've got, if you don't have this door shut, it won't turn, this, well, you can't turn it on. So he says. Oh. No, I'll just end up. No. So. There we go. <laughs> yeah, so if you do end, in, end up pushing that twice, you'll end up starting it. So, the controls are very simple here. Um, it's nothing complicated. You're not pushing different things to set time and um, like time and temperature. So on this side, you'll have a thermometer which controls your temperature. So you go up, and then you go up and down. Um, and then this side here, which is a well, let's say you've got a clock, which is your times. You go up and down. 
say, it does work, just a bit sensitive, where it doesn't want to know my thumb and fingers. And the timer can go up to 60 minutes, um, and then the temperature can go all the way up to 200. And uh, um, I don't know how far down you can go down on your time. Well, just one minute, I suppose. So you could go si one minute to 60 minutes, and then with the temperature, you can go all the way down to 65 degrees, unlike the tower one, which was 40. Um, so other functions, you've got the light. So when you've got the door closed, you can obviously turn the light on, but tap it again, turn the light off. Um, I'm assuming this one is a keep warm. Um, I'm gonna download a manual for this so I can kind of get, see what the other functions are. But the one with the lines is a, um, a preset. So when you go, you've got fries, you've got like a steak, like a chicken leg, fish, it looks like a shrimp. Um, like I said, that's the whole chicken. It's like 40 minutes, <laughs> that one. So that's at 200. And then it looks like skewers there. And then that one is four hours. That comes up as like dehydrate at 45 degrees. And then that is pretty much it. So, and then when you're not using your standard, like, pre, well, not standard presets, when you're not using your presets, you just literally use your, your temperature, any time. And then obviously you hit your, your start button. And that's pretty much it, really. Um, it's yeah. So there's not a lot that in here that I can say. I say not very very exciting. I'll just say a little bit of a bonus video just to, um, so that I've so just to show off, I suppose. Um, also one other thing, the door does have a latch, so you can obviously take this off and obviously manually clean it. Rather than it being hooked onto the um, hooked onto the air fryer itself, unlike the tower one where they are actually. So let me just quickly show you there. They are actually stay. They stay there. They so I think you can't take them off. So which is another good thing for like say for cleaning purposes. But yeah, that is pretty much it. And as, as I say, I will give a review of the um, of this. As I say, within I say a few weeks, so I'll put everything on properly, which I can't. And I'm guessing because of the, I'm guessing these are kind of the only two places where you can put them, because you've got the rotisserie thing in the middle. So, but still, you shouldn't really affect it. I mean, even if you just put that down there, just give it a bit of space, you're still going to have air going through anyway so but anyway that's so that's it from me in this video if you do like to see like more videos like this on like say um it probably won't be too many more of the air fries but anyway if you do want to see more videos anyway do also hit the thumbs up um do, do if you do like the videos don't forget to hit subscribe also and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my uploads i'll see you next time in another video